Hi, this is Wayne Mansfield with my uh, Book of the Week segment. Today I'm going to talk about three books. Uh, they range from motivational. So the motivational one is by a friend of mine called Terry Hawkins called Why Wait to be Great. We'll have a quick look at that in a minute. Uh, the next one is a how-to book. And a lot of us uh, are writing and getting ideas and sometimes you sit down to write and nothing will come. And I was in a, a bookshop in Mount Lawley, Western Australia, a fabulous bookshop called Planet. And I came across this book, which is called 642 Ideas uh, to get to write about. And of the 640, lots of blank pages there. And then uh, I thought I might also talk about the book that is the fastest selling book of all time, even faster than Harry Potter, and that's uh, Fifty Shades of Grey. So let's have a look at those books. Uh, we're doing uh, in the next couple of weeks our Power Read session. So there'll be a link here on the video if you want to come and join us for Power Read over the next uh, uh, four days in Brisbane, Sydney, Melbourne and Perth. Uh, so we'll, we'll look at how to read these books and how to read them really quickly. The reason that uh, speed reading for business is really important is there is uh, maybe a hundred books a year now uh, that need to be read if you want to keep up with business. Uh, and if you go back 30 years ago when the book called In Search of Excellence by um, uh, Robert Waterman and Tom Peters was first published, it's just had its 30th anniversary, there was only two books that year that talked about how to be uh, at the cutting edge of business. Uh, last year there were 75 books that hit number one and some of the ones that didn't get to number one deserve to be read as well. So speed reading is something you should have a look at and I've asked Lauren to put some links in the uh, the notes here of how to go there and book and join us. That's on about every 90 days with Australian Education Corporation. Okay, so the first book to look at uh, is by Terry Hawkins. She's uh, a good mate of mine who lives in Brisbane. She or work, lived in Brisbane. She now has a, a group that helps people overcome uh, issues from um, disruptive families and uh, uh, young people struggling to get ahead in this really complicated world. So I highly recommend this. Um, Ken Blanchard, who's the One Minute Manager, has written a testimony on the front cover and it says, you'll be a better person for having read this book. Having read it, I hope that I am a better person. So highly recommended. Uh, Terry Hawkins, good Aussie lass. 642 things to write about. Uh, the story of this was uh, an English writer at a university uh, asked his mates to come up with a number of ideas so that he could give to his students ideas for term papers etc. And he picked a number. I don't know why the number was 642 but he said to his friend can you get together a group of people uh, and come up with 642 ideas of something to write about. So let me share with you a couple of those ideas. Um, for example, describe an electronic device, the future uh, that you won't know how to operate. Or another one is, even a broken clock is right twice a day, give some good advice from a completely unreliable source and convince somebody to take this advice. Or another one here, recreate your earliest childhood memory. So these things, the idea is to spur uh, some thought patterns. So I'm using it to help me with blog posts. Uh, there's a couple of other books in the, in the series. They are really good thought starters. And the last one is um, the uh, Fifty Shades of Grey um, phenomenon. Uh, more books in this series have been sold than any other non-fiction book, uh, not in recent history, in history. Uh, we're doing some work with, uh, there'll be a link in the show notes to uh, where you can uh, have a look at the, the toys they talk about in the, uh, in the books. Uh, just in, in Australia, if you're looking at this from somewhere else, Target have just launched a, la a range of lingerie called the Fifty Shades of Grey. So this has passed over from uh, being something a bit um, talk about on the side in um, clothes company to um, it's become mainstream. Uh, and I recommend that you have a look at uh, this phenomenon about how we've changed from things that uh, were only available um, in CD back streets to uh, in every major bookshop in Australia, 
uh, th these books and there's a whole genre of book that they're now calling uh, steamy fiction. So uh, my recommendation, grab a copy of this, uh, the author's LJ James, uh, it's well worth a read. So until next time we get together and talk about books, uh, I look forward to sharing ideas with you. I also recommend or commend you to come to Power Read. Uh, that's uh, in the next couple of weeks across the country. Look forward to meeting you then. So this is Wayne Mansfield saying until next time, uh, good reading. Mm -hmm.